naturally gluten-free chocolate brownies. The perfect brownie recipe. Eat delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Hi, this is Chef Pachi. And today we have an amazing recipe for you. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna melt our butter and chocolate in the microwave for a minute and 15 seconds if it's a tiny microwave. I am using dark chocolate and this is gonna be beautifully amazing. Remember, chocolate makes people happy and also when chocolate products are not that sweet, they are more filling. So it's fantastic. Now we're gonna add our oat flour, our coconut sugar, our unsweetened cocoa, and a pinch of salt on one bowl. In the other one, we have our eggs, vanilla, and mashed bananas. Now we're gonna mix both dry ingredients on one side and wet ingredients on the other. I'm adding a cup of chopped pecans. You can decide if you add them or not. I love that crunch inside, the moist and chewy brownie, and it actually makes them taste delicious. Now we mix dry and wet ingredients. That's it. Adding all of that beautiful melted dark chocolate is gonna make these. Look at this mixture, I just wanna put my finger in and lick everything in that bowl. These brownies are amazing. They are easy to make and everyone at home is going to love them. I place them on a baking pan covered with a baking sheet. And this allows me to take them off the pan and cut them super fast, easy and which Ever size I want. I'm gonna cut them in squares, two different sizes, but you can make triangles and that's just Christmas tree. These brownies are gonna be loved by everyone. They are naturally gluten-free and they are delicious. Now that we have them all set, let's bake them and we're gonna bake them at 350 degrees convection for about 25 minutes and that's it. Look at this beautiful brownie with some little piece of banana right there that didn't actually get completely mashed. It's beautiful, shiny, moist, and delicious. And here's my hat. I wanna serve those brownies beautifully before anybody gets their hand in there. So I put another piece of wax paper on a baking pan, sprinkle it with some powdered sugar, and that's gonna help me prevent them from sticking to the bottom. Now I'm gonna cut them in four because this is an eight by 12 pan and I'm gonna divide them. I'm gonna make 16 brownies on one side and 12 on the other. This way you can decide which size of brownies you make. You can make them smaller, you can make them larger. The traditional way is like this, 16 per side, which would be 32 brownies. And here on the other side, I'm making some larger ones, so I just cut 12 pieces. Check this out. They are beautiful, moist, chewy, delicious, with the nuts, and look at that. It's amazing how moist they are, and they stay moist. It's the perfect brownie recipe. Now, we can serve them two ways. We can serve them just with some powdered sugar, or we can serve them frosted. With some powdered sugar, they look beautiful, and you do that in seconds. If you wanna frost it, come. Let's make our amazing almond butter frosting. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna measure half a cup of almond butter. And I buy almond butter that is unsweetened so that I decide how much honey or maple syrup I'm gonna use. If I use maple syrup, I add four tablespoons. If I add honey, I use two tablespoons. Then you mix it with two cups of Greek yogurt. And I buy non-fat Greek yogurt because my almond butter has the fat that I want. 
at the beginning it seems like it's going to be hard you can just like kind of cut through the almond butter while you make it soft and that's it now i mix this and check out this frosting handmade no mixer and divine it actually dries up also so you have no problem that they're going to stick one to the other delicious try it it could actually be something you serve with ice cream now let's check out another way of doing it some people don't want frosting we can just serve them with a little bit of powdered sugar and voila they look beautiful if you make triangles instead of squares they could also look like christmas trees then you can also have some with no frosting. So from one recipe, you can get three kinds of brownies. Brownies for everyone, delicious, healthy, heartwarming, any day. It's so, so good. Chef Pachi, delicious food, amazing mood. Enjoy, Chef Pachi. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.